watch you as you dry do you know i'm looking and i can't help but smile do you know how much i love you you put my favorite song on i put my feet up and we just sing along and i can't help but feeling just loving this moment can we stay here Stop the time, don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? Forever, forever, forever. I watch you as you sleep. You don't know I'm looking. You, everything's complete. Do you know how much I love you? I put your favorite song on just to wake you up. When I dance around, I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here together? If I could stop. I just ate one of these. It's called a booby bar. It's supposed to help your milk supply. Not that I need a bunch of help right now. I'm doing good, but pretty good. Yeah, do we spit up? Yeah. Mm. You need to be held. You need to go back in your little carrier. I'm watching some selling OC, and I was just trying to get some barbecue chips in my mouth. <laughs> Seven on his poor little head. Oh my gosh. That's what happens when you wait to, to eat the, the like very last of the bag, you know? It's just crumbs. Sorry. He will not let me put him down. So, he's in here. He's sleeping. He continues to spit up. It's been making a mess. Um, I'm gonna feed the animals and I think at that point, Everything's been done on my to-do list and maybe I can move on to my office. We'll see. I'm also kind of tired and just want to sit down on the couch and watch some TV, so we'll see. Went out to the garden. I know some of these are not ripe, but I had to pick that whole branch off and cut it because it was blocking another plant. But look at this. Did not even see this growing. Um, I'm not sure if this is going to be any good, but I'm going to have to try and eat that today. And I got some basil, lots of cherry tomatoes. These have been so freaking delicious and harlow is obsessed with them and speaking of harlow she's awake she slept for about an hour and a half which kind of sucks it's not very long but hey it's something so i have not made i'm gonna have to set her up on the tv and finish my animal chores um but they shouldn't take me too long my neighbor just dropped off some cookies that they made that's super sweet <laughs> i guess they put like a bunch of good stuff in there for breast milk um harlow just ate lunch now it's mom's turn i've got simple songs on so i can eat <laughs> I made some burritos. This one got stuck to my little stove skillet, so it's got a hole in it, but. Mm. Oh. She's like over here playing with this like baby twin. Where? <laughs> mm. I think we're gonna go on a walk after this. It's like a pretty gloomy day. So it's nice and cool out. I think we'll take advantage. Anybody else put avocado on their burritos? Mm, that's so good. Okay, let's take your, your tricycle. All right, we are gonna attempt to go for a walk before the nugget wakes up. Come on, Arlo. Or before it rains, jeez. Yeah. Good job. Okay, you ready? Wee. Wee. What Hi. is that? Hi. 
Is that an armadillo? Armadillo. <laughs> Good, nice, gentle touches. Good job. Nose. Nose. That's right. Where's his ears? Nose. Eyes. Yeah. It started to rain, so we had to come in from our walk. Oh, I just nursed this boy, and we're helping him sit up like a big boy. <laughs> Look at you. You're sitting up like all by yourself. Yeah. Oh, lots of that today. Oh boy. Very fixated on this. Mm. <laughs> Look at his little hands. So cute. Yeah, you should review that drop off on Amazon and be like, uh, yeah. not left in it. Hey, don't, she's like touching. Yeah. Harlow, no thank you. How are they doing, okay? Yeah, um, she's been a handful, as usual. Ah. When I was gonna have kids, I didn't anticipate being alone on the weekends. <laughs> 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 I uh, thought I was gonna marry someone that was in the evenings and good, home on the weekends. Good and, uh, had a good job. What? I thought you were gonna marry somebody that was good looking and had a good job. I did do that. That I did do. <laughs> do you want up? Hi, Harlow. Up. Say hi, Daddy. Hi, Harlow. Say hi. hi. Say hi, Daddy. Hello, Harlow. Say hi, Daddy. Mama. <laughs> All right, well, have a good rest of your day. All right, love you, bye. What's wrong, baby? What's wrong? What's wrong? Come here. The uh, sex pillow has made its way into the backyard for the kids to climb on, apparently. <laughs> Piper, yeah, Piper's pooping. There was a lavender bush here, uh, like a day ago. Um, not really too sure what happened to it. <laughs> I don't know if Nick pulled it out or what. That is so crazy. They pulled this out and it's already grown. I feel like I looked at that like a day ago and it hardly had a bud on it. Now look at it. Yeah! Get it! Yeah, good job! <laughs> Don't pop it, Pipes. You see a bee? <gasps> Piper, you popped the ball. All right, I just got this colored tape in the mail, <laughs> so I'm gonna try something here. Oh my gosh, it doesn't stick at all. I'm trying to stick all these up here. How lame. That tape sucks. I'm returning it. <laughs> hey, Zilly. Oh, Get the other toys. Oh, crash. Oh. Oh, thank you. Just put Harlow to sleep. And she's just been screaming. Nursing the boy right now. And I just, every night, actually for the past like month has been so brutal like this and nap time where she just cries. It's been a little brutal because like at the end of the day I'm like so tired and then I sit down and I just like want to relax and watch TV or like have dinner and I just hear her screaming and it sucks, so I hope it gets easier for her to go down. I feel like it's like she's going through like a phase right now or something, because it used to be like so different. Like she used to go down so easy. I still haven't eaten dinner. I need to eat dinner, but I'm nursing and then hopefully I can eat some dinner. I am hungry, very 
hungry. I can't get either baby to stop crying and I just want to eat dinner. Thanks, bye. I'm so freaking hungry and I just want them to be soothed and comforted and they're both just screaming. But nothing I'm doing seems to work. In moments like this, it's okay to just go in the garage and scream. Just scream. so dead right now it's like 9 11 ironically <laughs> that was nick and i's first date um my back is absolutely killing me uh today was hard yeah definitely wouldn't be a day in the life with a newborn without a cry session um very challenging yeah oh, i never anticipated like I always thought I'd marry someone that was home on the weekends and home at night, you know, but that's okay. Oh, I can't wait to go to bed right now. I'm actually pretty excited to have the bed to myself because I can put all my crap on this side, like my breast pillow and my phone charger and my phone. So it's not like right here next to his bed because he sleeps in the bassinet right here next to the bed. Um, so I'm about to nurse. Got the like living room as cleaned up as much as I could right now. Like I'm just so exhausted. My back is absolutely killing me. So I got all the dishes done at least. Um, hi Kiki. Hi Jessica. So I just like, I can't do it anymore. Um, plus I've got to get up tomorrow with Harlow again at seven. So I am very tired and need to go to sleep. I'm also very excited that I get to go to sleep without the TV on tonight. My husband, loves to watch TV and pass out. He always puts a sleep timer on the TV and I inevitably have to wear like an eye mask. And lately, because of this baby, I don't sleep with earplugs in right now. So it is just so hard to fall asleep. I think actually when he gets back from work, I'm gonna tell him that um, we're done with the TV at night, like right now while we're in the newborn trenches, the pits of the newborn phase, um, uh, because I just need to get sleep. So I haven't said that yet to him. So I think I'm going to say that to him when he gets off work. No more freaking TV while I'm trying to fall asleep. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'm sure that was, um, if you made it this far, you're probably like, dude, what the actual hell was this video? Because that's how I feel about my day. Um, yeah, very challenging. Very challenging. Harlow's also at that age where she doesn't really listen and there's not really much you can do about it because she's only 15 months old. And it's just, yeah, it's very frustrating and it really tests my patience. Um, and I'm praying for more patience to come to me because I'm not naturally a super patient person. So it's challenging for sure. Um, but anyways, yeah, thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this clusterfuck of a video, then give this video a thumbs up. It helps me out. Um, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye y'all.